So hello everyone and welcome back to Transistor where we were heading to this area to meet with some of the mayhap poses. I just have to... <laughs> I just gotta be remembering exactly how to do, do everything because it was a few days since I played last time. I didn't even press it out to be honest in my opinion but fine, whatever. Um, so yeah. Welcome back with another Advent Calendar Day, and hopefully you have had a good time thus far, waiting for the Christmas, and let's just uh, head on, and hopefully I will... I'll be getting into it relatively well. So, roof the badges. Process detected. Let's see... What? Oh, they are already dead. Question mark. I guess they've just rather committed suicide rather than meet us or sus. <laughs> Again, a problem. Left you a note. Mm, well, let's read the note, I guess. So that's it. Goodbye. Private message from Quindar and Asher. Re goodbye. Sent minutes ago from Bracket Tower Top. I couldn't stay to meet with you in person. Grant. He couldn't wait any longer. Why he would leave me? I'd sooner take an eternity in the transistor. But he was no longer seeing straight. Or perhaps he'd decided he'd seen enough. We knew the stakes of what we wanted to accomplish. And we knew that if we were to fail, we would do so together. As one. See you in the country. Okay, so they, uh, the Ash, uh, the other guy, I guess, uh, committed suicide. This guy came round, said that he apparently couldn't wait. He would have rather gone to be in the transistor in the sword together with this other person. So transistor as a sword is something that can collect people's souls or some sus. Strange as it may be, well, let's respond even though it's not like he's gonna be reading it, most likely. See you in the country. R. Right. What are you gonna do now? Deceased, 47 minutes ago. Disposition charitable. Come closer, Kendrell G. Well, grand plans though. Once they lost the transistor, they lost control of the process. Hmm. There's all of these uh, different enemies that we've been kind of meeting, sort of, here. Well. Hey there, remember me? Guy you killed the other day? Let me be the first to welcome you to your new home. Into the you transistor. Fake. And then we can collect this guy as well. Welcome to Disposition Loyal 15 minutes ago. He also didn't want to be meeting us, this Kendrel Asher. Wake up, buddy, got some questions for you. Yep, welcome into the us. transistor. Fairview. How are we supposed to get all the way over there? Oh. Oh. Really? Interesting, it even says that cowards. Well the they camera. Yeah, so one more left then when this boat decided to rather do and commit a... Okay, transistor diagram. Yeah, well, this is our sword, of course. <sighs> Which collects souls in it, or can collect souls, as it is. But we have one more left. Thought they could change the world with this thing. But the question is, what did they exactly want to try to achieve with this uh, transistor? What was the call, what was the aim, and what happened then when it lost, they lost the control exactly? No. Break the glass and the process swarms. No, if that's Jump really good. We're not gonna fall. Okay. We're just gonna jump for it then. Somewhere. But hey, that's, a, that's an interesting start. Ooh. Okay, well, we are not indeed <laughs> going to fall. We're flying with the process. The 
needs to change. For good. Mm. But not like this. They got greedy. Grant the others. Seems like it. Only one left. Only one left. He's gotta know something. Not Maybe. In Fairview. In Fairview. Alrighty, well, let's see if we can change this. Yeah, it seems very white. Surely seems like it. Surely seems like it. Hmm. Not exactly the best thing, I could say. Not exactly the very best thing. Oh well. We'll see. We'll just need to be finding this guy then. Was that again something like, uh, flying? I wasn't ready for you. Proxes upgraded again. Stunning bark now. Oh, another one. Let's just switch you. Blocked. I sometimes really wonder why it's saying that it's blocked. What's blocking it? Now it's at least switched. It can also get this switch and get a little bit of a healing back as sus if we so wish. Maybe send a little bit of a flood that way. Sure, I guess. At least it destroyed that, so there's that good side. I dislike that guy <laughs> when he's doing that. Uh, so I had this, yeah. I had the crashing this thing, so that's fine. Let's first dash or jaunt closer because it's more efficient anyways than me going and uh, doing the um, uh, walking uses less a jaunt let's do the breach so that we can get a little bit of a backstab and a little bit of a damage and then do flood I think should be pretty decent some uh, do I want to do another one into there maybe not maybe I want to try to send the flood over that way and then just walk this way myself and uh, maybe the wedge will get some extra damage from it. We'll see. We'll see. There he is. Oh yeah, I can't. <laughs> I was thinking that I would have already been able to just um, go back to the turn, but I, of course I couldn't. Turn may be used to break free from Wedge's 3.0 attack. Fine, but I do need the jaunt after this for a certainty. Ow. Yep, I knew it. I knew that was a very bad situation. Very bad situation. Kind of really annoying too, but what can we do exactly? Than anymore. I should have done differently after all. I'll just make sure that I'm gonna get him. Okay, good enough, I guess. But I should have, uh, I should have done better. I didn't like it when I lost Bridge. Clearly enough, not at all. But I'm not sure. Like, are we back on our stage? It seems like it. That we're back on the stage that we were on before, hey, but we got a full house. looks very different. Never get the feeling. Yeah. Of what? Ever get the feeling of what exactly? But yeah, I guess this is back to the stage that we were on before, where we met Sybil. Maybe I'm not sure, but it could be. But it's very interesting this process, going and taking over. Okay. <laughs> Cluckers. Status. Listening. Come closer. They're all right, like, seated and just listening to music? Question mark? Okay. Yes, okay. It's indeed also my question about this. What's exactly going on? I, I do not quite understand. At least we can frolic a little bit. Hello up there. This looks very... Probably getting his friends. I definitely can at least say Maybe that the... Uh, especially later on in this game, the graphic side style, the art style has been more interesting now with the different views and so on. Yep, yeah, started move there. 
Yes, I'm not too surprised. OVC terminal. That thing on. Seems like it. They think you. What a mess. What do they think? Red 27. So talking about us. Mourned as Protoss tall climbs. Okay, so they think us that we are dead. Vigil held for popular musician after she vanished in the week's catastrophic outbreak. Full story. In memory. Kind words, though. Well, at least. One of the Cloudpack's most influential voices has gone silent amid the process epidemic spreading through the city, unchecked. Red became active as a musician from a young age, though her popularity surged in recent years as her songs consistently charted in the top 10 percentile for the past five years, according to the OVC data. While Red is but one of the thousands of disappearances this week, thousands more gathered to honor her life and her music on the eastern perimeter, as the sound of her voice cut through the darkness. Well, we aren't exactly dead, but... None of this is coming true anymore, is it? Yep. Probably not. They don't know. Do you still hear me, don't you? Of course I do. It's good that we can at least talk. You're all I have. Red. There has to be a way to get you out of we'll there. We'll figure it out when we get there. We have to try. We will find a way. <sighs> to try to find a way to get you out of the sword. So, Amphitheater Parkway. Gotta retrace our steps. Get to where you found me. Retrace our steps. Get to where you found me. Interesting. Well, what do I want to use then? So, per I guess I can use the purge then when I can't use this. Which is very sad, but I guess. Select the function. Put it into use here. It at least does a dodge, it's slowed and everything like that. And I think I want to be then putting this into it, maybe. Invernable, immobilized. Target vernable, yeah. It does the target vernable, so that's nonetheless a good thing. Um, subdivide, raise the potency of most functions when backstabbing. Mm, that's also a good effect as sus if I feel like rather using the jaunt. What was the upgrade function of this anyways? I don't think that there's really any sense of having that there anyways. This is of course great, but of course it's already one of those that you can use any time. So, it's just a question. Do I prefer this or this? In all reality, I kind of prefer this, so maybe I should be indeed taking that off and then... Putting this on here, and then just putting this into it, because I kind of think that I would prefer that. Then I got these two that I can both install, considering I have enough points for it. Just a question, what and where? Spawn a copy when attack, diverting nearby targets would be a nice part, also passive slot effect. So I had this on the passive slot, otherwise... Move much further in a single use of turn. It's okay, but I think it's probably better that we put something else into there. So this would be spawn a copy when attacked, di diverting nearby targets, gain deflecting shield. So yeah, let's put this into the passive slot, I think. That should be pretty nice. Copy life is of course 20 and cooldown 1.5, but still, it will give us a little bit extra health, so to speak. So what about this? The add a chain effect, reactive effect to most functions and reduce turn planning cost and speed up most functions, which is of course lovely. Henter Chalford, we actually know more about him now too. How many cases must one crack to become the most highly decorated detective in the 18th president? Even this, Officer Henter Chalaford knew ahead of time, although he never acted prideful about it. Of course, Ch Officer Chalaford was no mere detective, he was a forecaster. This was one of the rarest and least understood professions in Cloudbank, though the results spoke for themselves. Officer Chalaford possessed an almost uncanny ability to solve and any mystery that blew him to town. So it was that that he became very interested in the reasons why central admi administrations quietly decided to take down the northwestern edge of the Goldwild district until further notice. 
investigations. Officially speaking, official Chelaford could only do so much until the administration provided sufficient clearance for his own safety. But one of the side effects of Chof Officer Chelaford's talents as a forecaster was his insatiable desire to confirm his hypothesis. So he decided to move forward with his investigation, sensing significant trouble and not wanting to sit idly by rather than do his job. What he discovered in cold walk shook Officer Chalaford to his core. He had never seen anything like it, and his hand shook as he prepared his report on the spot. But he ceased transitions uh, when several individuals approached him. He did not expect them either. So 49-year-old selection psychology and deduction. I believe the user can be parsed. Hmm. Then disappearance. The camarada knew Officer Chalaford posed a significant threat, as he was one of the only detectives stubborn and determined enough to refuse to accept the administration's non-committal answers about what was going on in Goldwalk. After considering several ideals, ideas that might draw the officer out, the camarada realized they needed only to be patient with him. After all, a forecaster could only predict what was already planned. After Officer Chalafort vanished, the 18th president fabricated a palatable explanation or palatable explanation for the public. The officer was approaching a retirement age, and together they agreed to name a quarter of his home distinct in his honor. Right, so that's that's the story there. I guess we could also look into right. there. Oh. I know the name, but not the man. Heard he got out of town a while back. So Royce Brackett, engineer in mathematics, reasons I had declined. Recorded. Mail 37. Once there was a great engineer, arithmetic was his medium and a city was his canvas. He planned the roads, building and byways. His work could not be more precise. Like everyone in Cloudbank, he served at the pleasure of the city's people. The city changed quickly and often, reconfiguring the best suit to contemporary sensibility. Thus, the engineer's work was ephemeral. He loved his crowd, but could not let himself become attached to the product of his effort. Right. So, this also is something that we haven't exactly read yet, but I think we can save some of the reading for a little bit later. There's some more information here too. As such, well, it's a lot more nice to read when you can read the full story, as in for example, here if we inspect, we have no or everything already of the of her. So, so where do we want to add this? Uh, chain reactive effect and reduce turn. Let's see. Where would we want to put this? I don't think it's that good in there, so I guess into this one. Um, yeah. Turn cost reduce twenty five percent. Attack speed plus one hundred and twenty. Percent, which definitely doesn't sound bad, even if this isn't unfortunately breach that I would prefer, but well, I cannot really be held. Bounce, I'm not sure if we want to even put it here. Number of jumps, 5, jump range, 350. I guess I can try it, see how it seems to be working for us there. Good as new. Yes, well, other than not having what I really would like to have. Oh, you got him. So it seems, <laughs> yeah, pretty much some more frolicking while we're traveling this very stranger this looking town. town it's yep, pretty much. Okay, I hate these guys. <laughs> I definitely do hate these guys. Okay. You seem to be sometimes moving so much further than I really want you to move, but... A little bit of the birch, then a flood, and a flood. I think it's pretty good. Let's do even another flood, I guess. Or maybe I should do this again. But it doesn't stack, which is the only problem with that. So it wouldn't die if I don't use another flood, but it does die if I use another one at least, according to this, and then just be ready to be going into stealth, I think. Go 
because I don't think I wanna exactly be dealing with having that reborn and everything. But uh, let's not do this yet. Let's try to make our pay a little bit more in into there, unless that happens, which is really annoying when it does. I hate these creeps who do this though. Very much do. <laughs> so annoying. I can't do this switch, unfortunately, which is quite saddening because it's blocked. So I better just try to move then, I guess. At least a little bit. Ouch. At least we got here now, so that's decent enough. We can do that. Send a little bit of a flood this kind of way and uh, maybe maybe do this first even. Ah um, uh, yeah, just do this first into this guy as well. And uh, I guess that's fine. Send a little bit of flood that way too. Unless I should try to do this first so we have him at least into our side for a moment. Oh, okay, that guy also got switched. That's kind of strange. But uh, I guess because it switches more of them, well, at least I guess there was some protection and all that. Okay. Guess I'll do some more of this. I would prefer to be able to get out of there, though. Out of dodge. Okay, let's do that there. At least get a little bit of extra damage. Okay. Okay, and then we just need to kill you, I assume. And nothing more. I do like Flood, though, very much. And I do like the bird just as, as a damage dealing. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Wasn't too bad. I do kind of like the, this as uh, as the ability here for sure, though. We are able to get breach back too now, though. So it's a question: Would I prefer to use this? Upgrade most functions, raising their range and velocity. Hmm. Specifically because I'm not sure I want to be using this here, anyways. But this is more expensive. So what would it be that I would like to take off? Not really anything necessarily. That's real good. And uh, this is good. Mm. Let's see, would this be better in here then? Uh, target penetration range 200%. Okay, so then it would be able to go future and some target penetration, I'm not sure. Uh, range 200%, project size velocity 200%. Velocity. Not sure how it would exactly mean in here though. Hmm. I think I will prefer to be having this in there though. Nonetheless. Just the same that we don't really have quite enough then to put this into action into somewhere, but. I guess that's fine. I guess I'll put it here, the spawns, even though I'm not 100% sure if it's completely good. But hey, maybe it will be good at times. Anyways. Yeah, definitely stranger. It's the box office again. It's the box office. So yeah, we are back into the area that we were in before. Which is very interesting. Quite interesting. For a certainty. I guess I will just be sending some floods over that way and just be preparing to do this if need be. I was hoping you'd do that. See ya. Okay. I don't know. Um as sus, I don't know if I would wanna be doing exactly the way I was doing now, but I guess it's fine. Let's send the flood this way. Hopefully it breaks these two. Yes, break shield. Break shield. Break shield, hopefully. 
And then a little bit more of a flood that way. I do like the flood. I do like the flood, and this is probably still always a good one to have. I just sent floods there. I like floods. <laughs> floods are real good. Specifically when it can also destroy that immediately. But yeah, we're back at the box office that we were in the start, so that's quite intriguing. Hey guys, what's new? Um I guess I'll just be sending some blood that way. I'm not even sure if I have any others alive here anymore, so... <laughs> yeah, that was kind of easy then. What about the OVC terminal again? Farewell to Cloud Bank. One reporter's eyewitness account of the city's final hours. No news left to report. No one left to report it. Hmm. Because the city is completely owned by the process now. Editorial. As I stand here on the eastern perimeter awaiting the inevitable, I am surrounded by my community and I am at peace. It has been my honor and my privilege helping spread the news of the day among the people of this city. And my only regret is having no more time to share with you all. To the west I see nothing and to the east there is nothing. And so we wait. Together. Shoulder to shoulder. We will not leave our fair city under any circumstance. I suspect even the process has figured that out by now. Farewell. So, maybe they are not alive at all, these, these guys then either, if they didn't want to leave the city and uh, the city is being taken by process completely. Everyone. Yeah, pretty much is How about we get out of here? everyone. Dead. Dot. 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 We had at least transistor, but most were not in the, our position here at all. Let's just do a quick save again, even if I plan to not be changing any of those things.